Hi friends Hi. and family. We're coming to you with another video and another box of snacks. This time from Munch Pack. So this is actually not a trial version. This is the full size version. We have not opened it. We took the plastic off so you didn't see my address, but also um, so that way we can open and reveal if this is by country. We're not sure. We've watched some other videos and we think it's kind of a mixed pack, but really we are super excited because this is our first like official full package. So it's a big one. we're okay. going to do the reveal now. Snacks from around the world delivered to your door. Let's see. Hmm. So on the top of the lid, it says download the Munch Pack Snack Scanner. So my assumption is, is that you can buy these snacks through their websites. Um, there's other box. So you watch one of our other videos, they actually sell the snacks. So on this one, you just scan the barcode on it and they'll probably just send it directly to you. Oh, and it says that it'll give you more um, about the taste, texture, and country of origin. Nice. So let's see. Okay. Cute little sticker. I need to make a collage. We're gonna have a scrapbook. And then we have a enter a win. Enter to win a free family pack. Oh, that's awesome. Take a picture, share on social, use hashtag munchpack. We're gonna be doing that. YouTube, we're gonna hashtag munchpack that. So please like and subscribe so you can do more of these videos. And we're gonna get into the snacks. Okay, I'm kind of excited for this first one because there's like a squirrel riding a jet ski. <laughs> Nothing's in English, by the way. <laughs> it says sabor. I know that's sabor. a grocery store in Florida. Okay, because it's usually Spanish. But this is no, this is from Brazil. Oh, okay. I don't, I don't know what it is, man. I don't know what it is. It's light. Feels like chips. All right. We just start with that one? One by one. We'll just one start. One by one. One by one. Here it is. Let's see. So, Operacio Squirrel. <laughs> that was my version of trying to say what was on the package. Mm. I'm thinking that they're probably like plantains. Uh, yes? Let's see. Oh. Mm. Corn flour, vegetable oh. fat, salt, prepared seasoning, artificial ham flavor. Oh, that's going to be <laughs> so good. Oh my gosh. The only thing better could have been bacon flavored. Uh, yeah, the stuff I can't read. Um, okay. I tear into it. Crunchy corn chips with ham flavor. Love it. Okay. Okay, here we go. All right. This is a big bag. It is a big bag. Oh, uh, it probably doesn't smell so good, though. It smells like ham. It smells like powdered ham. Okay. How, when did we get powdered ham? Okay, so, Hispanic. Okay, Puerto Rican. Okay, we use the little packets to do, like, if oh. you ever need to do beans and you don't have ham and you just need a... <laughs> make a flavor so there's a view of one so almost thing bugle i don't know i haven't tasted it yet sorry i didn't wait for you i don't hate it <laughs> but i don't love it <laughs> what it tastes like it tastes like it's light and crispy i like i like the texture yeah it is kind of like a bugle this ham flavor is weird though it, 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 yeah it is. It's artificially ham. And then like, what I also don't like is because it is so small when you chew it, it's the one that gums up in your teeth. So. Is it greasy? Mm, you don't mm. think it's greasy? No. It's gluten free. Oh, there you go. Oh, made of corn. Well, so. Second ingredient is vegetable fat. That's why it's greasy. Oh. So I'm not. I keep saying I don't like it. them, but here I go. I'm not hating it, but I'm not loving it. If I, they were sitting on a table, like a party, I would probably snack on those. If they're at my desk, I'd probably snack on those. Don't need would I purposely no. go and buy some? Eh, I'm not sure I'd go and do that. I don't know. Okay, so All right, next one. I would say take a swig of water. It leaves a film. Um, yeah, that's mm. a good note. Hydrate. It's yeah. good for you. Well, snack right. number two. Spent. Oh. Cheetos extra flaming from Mexico. 
Ooh, that might be good. All right, so this is what the package is looking like. Looks like there's a little contest in the front. Win money, that's what it says. So you may want to enter that, I don't know. This doesn't work out. <laughs> in partnership with Domino's and Bunko Azteca. So Cheetos Extra flaming Hot. Did oh, you have these? There we go. Yeah, you, I hope you took your medicine. Extra spicy cheese and chili flavored corn chips with sm smooth lime kick. Oh. Ooh. Okay, that might be different. So that's why the Flamin' Hot's different. This is weird. I'm excited. This is gonna be good. From all the sweet <laughs> stuff, it's nice to have a change. Ooh, man, those are red. And I'm gonna throw these puppies out. Look at the contrast of how red that is. So they're the good, they're not the puppy kind, but they're the good crunchy kind. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> these are gonna be spicy. Cheers. <laughs> oh, those are good. <laughs> oh, really good. You know when you're going to the chips and you're looking for that extra one with all the seasonings in it? Yeah. Every bag, well, everyone yeah. like this is in that bag here. Yeah. Okay, chip number two, starting to get spicy. When you're tasting it, first off. It is that lime or lemon flavor. Yeah. You get that that tang, which is really good, gives you that kind of like that mouth watering feel. And then you you filter it through with the, the spice. But obviously she's in, enjoying them. Oh, I'm sorry. Because they're really, really good. They are really good. Mmm. That's really yeah. good. Looks like a good book. Mm-hmm. We know those here. Yeah. Ooh. The heat doesn't last too long. But it builds up like right here where you feel like your throat's wet. <laughs> well, that's that tang. Mm. Uh, for me, it's that tang. Yeah. I think it's the lime flair. No. Is it lime or lemon? I don't know, man. I couldn't remember. It's at lime. Lime. Lime kick. We need these here. These are good. These are really good. If I'm like at a sa sandwich shop, I would, I would... They're not... You know, Cheetos has never been greasy, but like for the first two ingredients being the same as those other first two ingredients, these aren't greasy. Ooh, but I am tearing up them. These are... Those are good. Okay. Okay, you gotta take these away from me. Yes. Mm -hmm. Definitely say yes to the extra flaming hot. Those are those peppers are good. When I go to Mexico, from Mexico? I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, oh, yeah. I'm gonna look for those. Well, mm. Fortunately we're here in Texas, so we're close by, so hopefully there's a You want sweet? Uh, sure. Mm -hmm. Some will balance out that extra flaming hot from Cheetos. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do these. What are they, you ask? Gummy, Gummy strawberries, strawberries with cream. cream. Oh. From Vidal. Where's it from? Spain. España. Oh. Okay. Okay, I'll them before I, they explode. Um, Get it, strawberry. We just had a couple of greasy things, so, you know. <laughs> there we go. Okay. So there's the strawberry. There's the backside with the cream. Again, strawberry. Oh, they smell good. And the cream. See the contrast? They smell good. They smell really they good. Smell so good. Cheers. Oh my god. Oh, I just took a whole thing in your mouth. There's no like no. They're really good. You have big gummies, man. Mmm. So these are a little cold. It's cold here in Texas, so I'm assuming if they were kind of like room temperature, they would be good. They got really good flavor. Great chew, not overly chewy, not overly soft where they kind of completely stick to your teeth. And they got a good flavor. They don't taste so super sour. They're like super strawberry-like. Yeah. I really like, like these. Yeah. Spain, you got some good snack right there. Okay. I could imagine if they had like a peach or a watermelon. Oh, good kinds. Yeah. That would mm. <clears throat> Next Europe trip, I'm gonna to try to look for that. Those are good. That's for sure. All right. So, Vidal, Vidal. These are that. That's legit, right there. And those are in English. Yes. I think they're distributed in New York, by the way. Mm. But they're from Spain. That's okay. that's good. That was a good one. All right. One egg. What do you want? Let's do the ball. That just <laughs> the ball. That okay. just seems fun. I'm scared. How are you supposed to eat this? Here you go. Oh. Sweet birthday cake popcorn ball made <laughs> made with pucker powder. 
So this is gonna be fun after we just had a nice, sweet, delicate strawberry gummy. Now we're gonna have a birthday cake popcorn ball with pucker powder. From Kathy K. My nose is dripping from like the cheese. Oh. Where's it from? USA. What? I've never seen that. So, we gotta get out crunchy, of the gas station? I know. <laughs> crunchy popcorn ball with sweet birthday cake flavored coating. Made in a peanut and tree nut free facility. So that's good. Oh, wait. I, I have never seen this. I haven't seen it either. You know what? If you see this and they actually sell it wherever you live, please comment below because I want to know where you can buy this. I have yeah. never seen this. I've seen popcorn balls for Halloween, but not like. And I've been in. to my share of sketchy gas stations. So <laughs> I have not seen this. Well, hopefully it's not at a certain large grocery store chain that I don't drop at. Well, we make our way around. We did. <laughs> All right. I'm sorry, I took the whole popcorn. Oh, that's okay. So it looks like on the inside. So it looks like a standard popcorn ball. Smells like popcorn. I'm scared about the sour pucker stuff. Well, but then the description didn't say sour pucker. It just said on the bag. So this is where the confusing part comes in. It smells in. sweet. Yeah, it smells, it smells like real pink. sweet. Sorry for the face. We're going to have to bite into this. I'll let ladies first. You can oh, I thank you. Yes, because I'm going to make this look very, very glamorous. <laughs> okay. Ooh, you guys oh. have some strong teeth for this. Whoa. All right. Here we go. Mm. That's really sweet. That birthday cake sweet. Ooh, that is sweet. I don't know what the pucker powder is, but. I have but... no idea. Do you have to get to the middle? I don't think I can get no. to the middle then. Yeah. It tastes like cake batter. It, it just tastes like sugar. Like artificial cake batter, and you need the popcorn to carry the taste. Okay, I need some water on that one. Ugh. Well, yeah, no. That was not a fan. Sorry. Don't go chasing. Don't. Tell us where it's at, but... I'm still curious, because it might have other flavors. Mm. Yeah, see? You gotta keep open mind. Yeah. Mm. Oh, Judge. That was really sweet, oh, though. Judge. Really sweet. Alright, let's see. Ooh, um... Mm. Sweet? Sure. I know you don't even like sweet, but I think it's funny. I don't know who you are. Okay. Well, I covered up the name. Where's it from? Let's see if I can peel this off. So it's Kinder Country... Milk and cereals bar. Is that the same place where it would be the Kinder Ball thing? That little thing with the toy? The chocolate? I don't, I don't think so. This one is made in Poland and no chocolate with milk filling <laughs> <laughs> and crunchy rice bit. Okay, milk filling. Come on now. I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> it's creamy. Oh, it looks like. Our crunch bar here in America on the back side. Oh, it's nice that they got little broken squares. Mm -hmm. Show everybody what the milky creamy middle looks like. Look at that. We got creamy milky middle. It smells like chocolate. It smells good. I'm almost thinking it's like Oreo Oreo and cream. Oh like a cookies and cream? Mm-hmm. But the little rice thingy, whatever, is really prominent. Oh, it is really different. Um, I don't know. <laughs> um, All yours. <laughs> <coughs> um, it's yeah. like. It's oh, the chocolate's okay. Let me just let me be straight with y'all. The chocolate's terrible. The cream is terrible. It almost tastes like got nuts in it. Oh no, no, I'm sorry, it's no. It's so sweet. No. It's, it's nothing like condensed milk, is it? Oh, I don't know. I don't know why I'm trying to read this. Uh, um, I don't know nobody from Poland. Yeah. I can't read this. I just no, start... thank you. Oh. Pass. Um, that would be a no. I mean, no. It's sweet. So if you're a sweet tooth. No. Get better chocolate. I'm sorry, my friends will not like that. No, it's still right there. 
I don't pass up many things, but that, I'll go for the ham flavor. Oh, together? Ew. No, no bueno. It tastes so much better. All right, let's peel the sticker off of this one. So, what is it? What are we going for? What country are we in? It's called Chicky. Chicky, Chicky, Chicky. Sorry, Chicky. Chicky, Chicky. Six galletas. Galletas. Cookies. Yes. And it is from Costa Rica. Yeah. Sorry. Crunchy cookies with sweet vanilla cream. Oh, we're just sticking with the cream part here. <laughs> So they're just, they're just like cookies. They're just like, like... But are they going to be like those... A vanilla Oreo or a Grandma cake? made. Oh, it's in a package. I don't think anything's going to be like grandma made. You know those grandma cookies that are like 99 cent at the gas station? They got the cream, the little round ones that you can get on cheap. Oh, you're different. Oh. Oh, my, my, mine's missing the back. Oh. I'm backless. Oh, the top. Oh. Oh, oh. that... I'm wondering if that's the whole cookie. Oh. Is that supposed to be the whole cookie? It's not a sandwich. Cookie? No, no, no. Here's, this is the whole cookie, I think. Oh, no. You got two. Oh, okay. Please don't keep doing that. I was trying to be greedy. There you go. That is, that it smells, is. It smells like white chocolate. I'm not the biggest fan of white chocolate. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, I like that. Well, the cookie's not so sweet. I actually like it. The cookie's not super sweet. So, it almost tastes like coconut. I've eaten these cookies before. There's oh. somebody that makes this here somebody in the United States. Yeah. I've eaten cookies like this before. Mm. I like that one though. These are good. And this one, you can tell, this one's more toasty. This one's got a little crispier on the top. Darker brown. Yeah. Vanilla mm. dipped cookies. That these are good. really good. I know, it's almost kind of like a little coconut flavor to it. These like remind me of what I ate as a kid. Mm. I don't know. I don't know. Those are good. So I like the surprise of the munch pack versus the other snack kind of boxes is that you get like multiple different countries. However, I do like the other ones that just give you a country and then you try out multiple okay. ones. I haven't figured out which one I like better, but I do like the variety of snacks that are in this one. So, so far, thank you munch pack for giving us such Great little tasty snacks. Definitely tell you which ones are our favorite. Continue to follow us. <clears throat> All right. You have your option. If you go to South Korea, if you go to Turkey, if you go to UK. Turkey. All right. You got two turkey. Okay. Which one do you want? Uh, let's do small. Okay. What uh, is it? Okay. It's called Amada Choco Love Fingers. All sort of what wrong What are they that. called? Amada Choco Love Fingers. Love Fingers. <laughs> You're going to eat some love fingers. Yes. Ooh. Crunchy rolled wafers filled with hazelnut cream and coated with milk chocolate. So again, not the fan of Let me hazelnut. Just <clears throat> Amada Choco Love. Not making it up. All right, there we go. <clears throat> That's a lot of sweets. We serve with all the salty. <laughs> yeah, we. I'm gonna need them flaming hot. Oh, there's two. Back. Oh, they look like they're pirouettes. So turkey's version of a pirouette, chocolate coated. Ooh, are they empty in the middle? Are they hollow? Yes, yes. they are. <gasps> I can taste them. They smell good. They smell good. Well, mine's coated on the end. Cheers. Oh, rub that with that. Oh, I like these. Wow. Oh. I like these love fingers. Okay, inside, it's actually coated with more chocolate. Mine's got a lot in there. But you can see the cookie. That's actually good. I'm not a big hazelnut fan, but... I don't even taste the hazelnut. Just go. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even taste the hazelnut. It's chocolate. It's chocolate cookie. It's like a pure wet, but more delicate. I like that. That was really good. These are good love fingers. I just like to say love fingers in my mouth. Mm -hmm. These are good love fingers. Choco love fingers. Woo! Here's another sweet one from Turkey. Oh, wow. Solon Crazy Extra from Turkey. Crunchy wafer with puffed rice coated with milk chocolate. Crazy Extra. I'm surprised 
wonder how sweet their stuff is. I don't know. Do they get a lot of sugar? I don't know, but everybody keeps telling me that the U.S. has so much sugar and everything's super sweet. But, like, I'm, like, eating these candies and they're, like, really sweet. It's just an interesting company logo on the back of it. Opening this up. Here's what the bar looks like. What is that? Are those little Those chips? are the rice puffs. Oh, so it's like a whole crunch bar? Oh, there better not be caramel in it. I didn't say caramel. It looked like cookie all the way through. It's going to be crunchy. Oh, it's crunchy. There's what it looks like on the inside. So it almost looks like a, a like, supreme Twix. It's like a lot of chocolate. Ooh. Yeah, no. Yeah, Twix? Oh, yeah, I would cheer for you. I, I'm sorry. I know we have a, a thing. I don't put you. Oh, that's good. I like this. I don't like that. It's not as sweet as you think it would be. No. That's good. It's crispy. Mm -hmm. I like the extra cookie layers in it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Really light. I wonder if it says extra. So I don't know if that's just because they're extra crispy. Or extra thick. So maybe they do have a version of this that's skinnier and that kind of looks like our Twix. Or not Twix. Kit Kat. Kit Kat. Yeah. Yes, Kit Kat. It's like a Kit Kat. I know it's something. Oh, look at the pretty design on the bottom of it. Oh, it is pretty. It's almost kind of like a diamond pattern. That was good. I like Kit Kat. I like that one. I, look, I love Kit Kat. Kit Kat. I'm just saying, I eat Kit Kats. Me too. Okay. I will go for that. We're gonna go to England. Huh? Ooh. No. I just came back from there. We'll go to and England. I didn't get any snacks from there, so. Mm. Well, the UK. Sorry. And I shouldn't say England, right? UK. That's different. Okay. Tinny Taffy. <laughs> Chewy candy. <laughs> Ooh, this should be good. From the United Kingdom. And they are chewy peach flavored taffy. I don't think I've ever had a peach taffy. I don't think so either. We don't do a lot of peach taffies here. Because peach is really like a southern thing. We do peach drinks. Oh yeah. We eat peaches. Millions of peach peaches. Popper. Peaches for me. Millions of peaches. You're aging yourself right now. No, sorry. Nobody knows what that is. I do, but I'm not going to make it right now. Is there one in there or two? Wow, this sucker's big. I think there's two in there, so I'll have her share. Oh. Her other half. Oh, I thought this was just one. <laughs> I was like, oh, pretty much. Man. I was like, this thing's big. I thought it was like an hour. Oh, well, while she is opening it, I will show you what the little package on the inside no, dude. looks like. You on your own. You gotta get your own piece because this sucker's like. Oh no, no, I'm kidding. Ha, huh? just kidding. Oh, yeah, okay. So when you open one, four of them in there. So that's what you the original, and that's what you get. Oh, four. You get four. Oh, nice. Four in a square. They're dainty. Oh. It's a little wax paper. Okay, not the color I expected. Oh. It's white-ish. They go hard, but mildly soft. Do they smell like a peach? Uh-uh. They don't smell like anything. Okay. This tastes like an hour later. Oh, if you chew it enough, peach comes out. Mm-hmm. At first you go like, mm. Oh, yeah. The tartness is starting to come out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it's got a good flavor. I like it. Mm. I didn't think I was going to like it. Oh, good. Definitely would eat that. I again. like that they're individually packed. And they're small. So no coloring added, gluten free. Mm. And I like that they're not like the big ones. You know how you get the big an hour later and then they're like out eating for like ever? Yeah. No, this is good. I like oh, that. I think they're in Canada too. Yes, I, I did. No, I like those. Those are good. All right, our last couple, last two, Korea. Sweet or salty? Uh, sweet. Let's stay on the sweet train. Here you go. South Korea. More chocolate. Lati Choco Cookie Caro. Those look like Pocky sticks. They do. Sorry for the way there. Apparel? Crunchy biscuit sticks covered with chocolate cookie bits and milk chocolate cream. What's with the cream? Uh, they just like to describe it. I opened it correctly this time. Yay! <clears throat> oh, in a bag. In a box. How many sticks for a serving? A oh, one these pack. Are, these are kind of broken up a little bit, so grab one of the longer sticks. 
Cheers. 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 Chocolate. It's good. Not, I like it. They're not as sweet as I thought they would be. Well, I think the biscuit tastes a little salty. Okay, say the biscuit flavor comes out a lot stronger. Mm hmm. Than like a pocky. Yeah, because the pocky usually just kind of. The pocky feels more like a cookie. Yeah. But this actually tastes more like a. Breadstick. Uh huh. No, that was no. actually pretty good. That was good. I like it. That'll be gone later. Yeah. That was good. With the flaming Cheetos. Last. So before we get into this, please like and subscribe. Munchpack, if you want to shout us out, we're going to hashtag Munchpack. Show you that we're all into this and we're in it. This is really good. So we're going to have our next box next month. So our final food is from South Korea. Marine Boy, not fried, baked snack. And it's got cute little animations on there, little squid and fish. They're little pirates. Look at the little pirates. And on the other side, sorry. Oh, pirates? Yeah. Oh, they are pirates. Oh, go crab. I so, like how I feel cultured. We've gone around know, the world right? with food, you know? That's what we do. I know. <laughs> it's our education. You can't travel, you just eat your way through yes. it. Yes. So, crunchy sea creature shaped crackers baked with seaweed flavor. So, nori Yum. flavor? Mm. Yep, nori flavored crackers. All right. I, so, made by Orion. I am ready. This is gonna be. I'm excited about this. I, I mean, like because, seaweed. Mm, sometimes you crave some seaweed. You're like, mm mm. From the bottom of the sea. You know it's legit when you can't read nothing on the <laughs> inside. <laughs> All right. Cute little package. What kind of sea creatures? Do okay, you have? let's let's do the smell test first. Oh, it smells good. You open the box. Oh Lord, here I go. Smelling. Oh, so they're multiple different characters. This looks like a little platypus, but it probably is a turtle. <laughs> we have like a dolphin looking man. We have a crab in here. I don't I don't know what that's supposed to be. What is that? It looks like an arrow. Oh, that could be a squid. Yeah. I think that's a squid. All right. You know it's squid. Mm. <laughs> okay. Why do I feel like I ate a squid? For real. So. That wasn't fried with calamari. That was marinara sauce. But think sushi. It tastes like sushi. Yeah. So if you're like craving a sushi snack, but you don't want to get like sushi, you just get the little crackers. No. Okay. No one goes, mmm, I want the fishy smelling crackers. These, We've all had shrimp chips. These, these suckers. Yeah. This did not say shrimp. This said. No. This said seaweed. Seaweed. I think they're not too bad. Seaweed taste. Yeah. It's, not bad. It tastes like I licked a fish. <laughs> it does taste. <laughs> Can you imagine the bad breath after this? Oh. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> we're about to go to dinner with some friends. And be like, Boy, we're going <laughs> to. Oh, we're bringing this to them. Oh, yes. Yes. Yeah, I need to try some of this. Ugh. Ugh. No. Anyways, no. like and subscribe below. Yes. Definitely would love to do more of these videos, <laughs> but we need your support. So please, please, please subscribe. That's more important. So you know every time we post a new video, we're going to try to do this weekly so that way you have some great entertainment to watch. And until next time. Bye. I'm going to be skinny in North, South Korea. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>